Hello everybody and welcome to Skyfall. Trust me, this game is completely unrelated to James Bond, but what it is is a rather interesting little platformer slash survival-ish thing. Uh, it is normally $1, but at the time of recording for the next nine days, if I'm not mistaken on my math here for the day that I'm uploading this, uh, it will continue to be free. So you can just go claim it on itch if with your itch account. Otherwise, it is a dollar as of normally. Now, this is a Skyfall focus all night long. Uh, and essentially what, what it is to, to explain it pretty clearly, um, it is a survival game where you play in a procedurally generated 2D kind of spherical planet and you are a little spherical head thing and you run around and you collect bodies of yourself. These are dead versions of you. You put them into a little cloning device and it clones them as extra lives. And then aside from that, you run around and collect different resources and things kind of unlock from there. Um, and then every night when the sun goes down, little missiles show up to blow you up. It's, I, it's a fun little gameplay loop and it has a neat kind of little bit clunky teleporting mechanic. I just, I want to show this to you because I think it's interesting. So the controls are pretty simple. You, you, you walk around and jump with the arrow keys and then uh, you collect bodies of yourself right here and you pop them into there. Um, you also have this little hard, albeit kind of hard to use currently, but you can make it better, uh, teleporting ability where you can hold down space and get kind of like a secondary jump. Um, and then you go collect more of your bodies and you dump it into your little cloning device here. And then you go find more. And of course, uh, if, if, you, if you don't make it uh, and you have bodies in there, you can take over one of those bodies. Um, so it also kind of becomes a little bit of Space Invaders where you see there's these uh, rocks everywhere. When the missiles come in, you're going to need things to block uh, the, their, their paths so that you don't just get horribly murked, um, which of course will happen. Now, as you can see in the background, the sun is setting. So we're going to have to survive the night momentarily. The music kind of kicks up a little bit. Here come the missiles. Let's see if oh I can't get up there. Come on. And then also pieces fall down. So we need these pieces. Which makes my upgrade better. Makes my jump better. Oh. Come on. There we go. It also makes it recharge faster, and from what I can tell, it also makes the um jeez. It also makes the uh, recharge quicker. There's another upgrade up top there. Let's see if we can get up there. Same with over there. Mm, I need some missiles to knock this out first. Eh. You mind? <laughs> I mean, geez, come on. Give a little orb a break here. All right, there's one coming. Perfect. So now it is morning and the, the sun is up. Let's see if we can... Oh, all of our upgrades disappear because it's morning. So now we got to go find our bodies. Uh, where did we die? Far over there on the right, I think? Let's go grab that. It's a neat little gameplay loop, but very simple. Like, there's there's not a huge amount to it, but like a... Oh, there's something up there. Oh, there's a body up there. Let's see if we can... Uh, I don't know if I can actually get to that one. Let's try. Might need to wait for another night to pass before we can start getting up there consistently. Yeah, and I definitely can't get up the side there. So I guess we'll, we'll go around to the right here and see if we can find the other one that we left. There it is. Much easier to find. Go grab it. Sun's going down pretty quick, as you can see in the background there. It does go down quite quick. Days are real short. We're definitely not in Finland, that's for sure. And as the sun goes down, we can get more upgrades. So... See how long we can last through this. I r really want them to hit the far side of this. Perfect. There's one. Nice hit. Coming in from the top. When they come in from the left side, it's going to be concerning. There's something. So now, as you can see, our teleport gets a lot better. Ooh. That was suboptimal. Although, look at this over here. How convenient. Okay, let's just get rid of you. Okay. <laughs> Not going to be able to get this done. 
Perfect. Something. Oi, 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 oi. Okay. Come on, boys. Let's just hold out for a second. Let's just throw you back in there. Convenient place to keel over. Oh man. Okay, let's go grab that scroll up there. See what that nets us. Assuming I can achieve the height necessary, which I think I can. Our uh, teleport has gotten significantly better. There we go. Let's wait. And there we go. You found a fragment! A poem fragment. Alright. Yeah, they, that's where that other body was. Oh, hey, there's also that one up there now, too. Because they do fall down from the sky occasionally. Hence the name. Oh, come on. I wonder if I can carry two at a time. I don't actually know. Right, well, that gets us a second one. Helps our chances somewhat. But here we go again. <laughs> that was over quick. You can't take me. Hey, it didn't matter because <laughs> made it there in time. All right. <laughs> okay. This might actually be my strat going forward. Just constantly respawning. They're not very effective missiles. They don't actually kill you. They just make you wish you were dead, you know? Because you just immediately respawn. Imagine living that life where you're just like, oh yeah, die horribly, and then moments later just <laughs> reappear having to deal with it again. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Let's go grab that upgrade. Oh, come on. That's another one. Ah! Oh, jeez. Didn't even see that one coming. But I love this game's color palette. I, I, lo I love it when a game has a style that they go for and they commit and they nail it. Because this game has an aesthetic and a look and a feel and a vibe. And I think all of those things land perfectly. Uh, my favorite music in the game so far is probably this daytime music. This very mellow, chill thing. And I kind of wish that the, the combat music was a little bit less repetitive. But it for, for uh, the low price of free currently and a dollar normally, I think this is a neat little game to check out. If this is the sort of thing that you're interested in. There's also neat little things to discover and find, like this plant up here, which I saw one of when I was playing previously before I reset my progress. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Hmm. Let's try a little further from this way. There we go. Found a new palette. Now I can change the color of the world. Ah, there's another poem fragment over there. Not happening. Get somewhere a little safer, just so that when we die inevitably, uh, you know, it's not so bad for us. Oh. Save. Hey, I think I, yeah, I still picked up the upgrade. Died anyway, but uh, doesn't matter, got the upgrade. Okay, let's go grab the me. Oh, you died trying to let's give it no shot. So yeah, obviously we're we're not gonna keep our our upgrades. Go we go back down to Babby tier, little kid levels. But Skyfall, one dollar normally, free currently. Let's see if there's any ground cover and things that we can pick. Oh, there's one. Perfect. Come on, little guy. Trying to remind, like remember what these little characters remind me of. They, they they remind me of something from my childhood, and I can't quite put my finger on it. It was like Mad Balls or something. Maybe, maybe, I I swear I dreamt this up, but that that that's a video game that exists, right? Maybe they just kind of look like weird off Pac-Man. I don't know. <laughs> that, that I can do, I think. Yeah, it's two. Not a bad start, I do say so myself. Perfect. 
Take this, you missiles. Miss this. Now, I don't actually know if you can run far enough to, like, loop back around to home base again, but that'd be real neat if you could. Really could use some upgrade... upgrades. Upgrades. <laughs> Not. Okay, so now it's mission recover body. And then as, like, the, the upper areas get destroyed, power-ups become more plentiful. There's that thing that we can grab on the way back. All right, let's just grab you. It's also, it, th th this little jump teleport mechanic is kind of neat because like you expect a game like this to have like a double jump, but it doesn't, it just has this, which is kind of a double jump, but also kind of not. So it does take a little bit of getting used to it. And as a gimmick mechanic, it's neat. All right. All right, all right, all right. I'm doing better now. If we can find anything during the day, well, we're a little safer. There's a poem fragment. So. Oh, there's another body. Ah, oh, come on. You know what? Let's let's try going the side. Come on. Before the sun goes down. We have to deal with Skyfall. Not to be confused with Timefall. I think I might still try and... Oh, boy. It's so precise. All right. Oops. Okay. <laughs> that was a very close one. Wait, can you see that big old asteroid or am I crazy? Hmm. Well, I walked into that. I'm really hoping that we can get another upgrade before this night ends. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, well, the fuck, fine. If you insist. Okay, there's something up top there. Ah. Sun's rising. It is quite lovely when the sun starts coming up and you're like, ha, oh, safety. I could see this game turning into or being expanded into a bit more of a survival crafty-ish thing, but I don't even know if I'd want them to do that. Just because I'm not super fond of a lot of survival crafting games, as you might know if you watch this channel. It's just not a style of mechanic I've, ever, I've traditionally enjoyed. I'm sure that there will be one day where I find a game that I absolutely fall in love with, but I haven't found that game yet. Bring our clone over. And four. All right. It's that time again. Bond you fucking. This seems like a good spot to camp in for a sec. Seems to be kind of the, the strat here. Hey, look, it's kind of like a funky looking cat bear dog thing. Now it's just got a hole in its head. Ow! Okay, that was a bomb. I was wondering what those were. I saw one of those fall a while ago and then didn't actually see, see what happened to it because it was just off screen, but I don't know why I expected that to be a pickup. It's very clearly an explosive device designed to horribly blow me into a bunch of itty bitty little pieces. Come on, little boy. Get your baller friends back home. Ooh, there's another fragment up there. It's also quite awesome just how 
far you can actually get with this. Like how high you can get so quickly. Only a couple upgrades. Like all the upgrades we got were on the first night. Yet here we are. Going pretty high up. Needs a jetpack. Bouncing over stuff. Moving about. Might just wait until winter. I mean winter, nighttime. Nighttime, nighttime, nighttime. They might wait for winter, winter too. But to those of you who've been, you know, watching my channel for a little while, or even if you're new here, what do you think of these videos? How are we doing? Is the game selection good? Is it weird enough? <laughs> you know, I like the uh, obscure indie stuff. Where we roll. All right. Another round of bombs. Did it. Okay. That might actually be my exploit for this, is just camp on base. Uh-oh. 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 That's not good. <laughs> okay, so, um... Screw that strategy. If you could even call it a strategy. Boo! I think this planet wants me dead, guys. <laughs> I was just, like, starting to think, like, yeah, this is... This Starting to get into a groove here, and then this this level's just like, nope. Shit's exploding everywhere. Rockets are coming in from on high. It's a might nightmare, and we've died. Skyfall, ladies and gentlemen, it's got, it's got absolutely nothing to do with James Bond. View poem. Oh, ignorant Mero Kithab. Punishment thou shall endure, cliff absorb dareth. I think is what that says. Unlock the whole poem for yourself. Of course, um, now that we're, we've unlocked some pallets as well. Ow. <laughs> we got wisdom, which is the default. Pain, which is this one. Uh, faded blood. Not sure why that's faded blood. I guess like a very light red. Old gold. I think Wisdom's my favorite still, but curious to see what the others look like. Neat little game! I like it. It's strange. It's kind of got some art stuff to do with the, uh, like, the lore being in a poem. Music's catchy and fun for what it is, and, uh, it's cheap if you catch it on sale for a dollar. Otherwise, currently, it is 100% off and free, so go download it. Go, go try it out. Shoutouts to 89O, I think is how you say the name of the studio slash developer that made this. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you want to see more stuff like this with games that you've never heard of, uh, check out my YouTube channel. I got a lot of it. As well as uh, I stream more Dwarf Fortress than anybody could reasonably watch in a lifetime, which you can find over at twitch.tv slash blindirl. If you want to support these videos and my content, you can do that over at patreon.com slash blindirl. Thank you very much for watching this video, and I hope to see you in the next one. Also, if you like my voice, I have a podcast over at housingfrequency.com. Thanks for watching.